Commander Dougal Cleland, Commanding Officer HMAS Warramunga. So over the last 24 hours, whilst patrolling in the Western Indian Ocean, a Royal New Zealand Air Force Maritime Patrol aircraft detected a suspicious vessel. Warramunga was operating in the vicinity, therefore uh, at sunrise yesterday morning we were able to intercept that vessel and place one of our boarding parties on board. And after a period of questioning of the master and the crew, it became apparent that the vessel may have been involved uh, in the smuggling of illicit narcotics. And a short time thereafter, uh, after a very thorough search, a quantity of heroin was seized from the vessel. 
So at sunrise yesterday morning, HMAS Warramunga's boarding party uh, boarded a suspicious vessel that we believe may have been involved in smuggling illicit narcotics. After questioning the master and the crew and a thorough search of the vessel, 915 kilograms of heroin worth approximately 274 million Australian dollars was seized from the vessel. So I would say the ship's company performed throughout yesterday's boarding evolution uh, methodically and professionally, which is a real indication of the value of the training that the ship's company has undertaken for approximately 12 months before actually coming away on this deployment. So in the 12 months before deploying, HMAS Warramunga Ships Company underwent a comprehensive training regime back in Australia. That training has been central to our success. Understandably, the crew are enormously proud of their achievement, but there's a very deep level of satisfaction to know that those drugs and that money will now be out of circulation, thus making both the region and the globe a safer place.